Ah, tomato, tomato. You call it a magnetic multi-stage linear mass accelerator? I call it a gauss gun. Hey, check it out. This is a fun one. Pretty simple, really. I've got a wood track and I've taped stacks of magnets to it with two steel balls at each stage. When I let the first ball go, it'll smash into the first magnet and most of its energy will go through to the third ball, which rolls down to the next magnet and so on and so on. We are transferring and adding to the momentum. It kind of reminds me of the energy transfer that we see in the Newton's Cradle toy. Safety cork off, ready, and... So here's how you reload the thing. You have to pull each ball back, so you have a pair in each stage. Put my safety cork back, and the trigger ball, and then the projectile up front. Here's your advancing robot army. Here's your dramatic music. And don't blink. It's very hard to see, but you can actually hear how the collisions are speeding up through the stages. Check it out in the slow motion sound. You can hear how the last two are closer together than the first two. That's because the balls are gaining speed with each magnetic boost. So then I was wondering how much boost does each stage provide? So I set up a ruler and ran tests with one stage, two stages, three stages, and four stages. Then I averaged the results. You can see I picked up about one inch for every stage. Makes sense as every stage adds a little more energy to the system. Yes, I crunched the numbers, I did the math. I'm getting a muzzle velocity of 1.46 feet per second. Not spectacular. The Gauss gun was a fun project. Easy to build, you could scale it up, add more stages, bigger magnets, have some fun with it. Thanks for watching, like and subscribe.